Hey guys and welcome to my video. So today I'll be doing a booster box opening of some Tactical Evolution. This is a first edition booster box and uh, I picked up probably this is my fifth or sixth box. I can't remember. I have so many of these. Um, should have bought a whole case but whatever. Uh, we're just going to get right into it and see what we can pull. So I've opened so many packs of this set. Um, I absolutely love the uh, secret rares in it, especially Rainbow Dragon. So, the seal is off. Such a good looking booster box. All right. So, there we go. Some tactical evolution. There we go. Let's get right into it. Alright, first we have Ojama Knight. Razor Lizard gift card. Ooh, and an ultimate hero alias. Nice. First pool, nice. That's an awesome card. <clears throat> it's really not much to say about this set. It has a lot of uh, chrysalis cards, snake cards. Um, there's a snake rain. So. Not much else besides those two. A grass chopper. Cocoon party. Hold on one second. Alright guys, sorry about that. So let's get right back into it. Let me refocus. Don Break Gardener. Ooh, sweet. A rainbow dragon. Holy crap. Nice. Epic. That is sweet. Oh, well, that made this box. Um, there's only one other secret. Actually, two other secrets that I think are worth it. Um, besides the rainbow dragon. Uh, there is... The Ghost Rare, obviously, but I'm not talking about that. Um, it's Venomanaga. That's one. And then uh, I'd say Cyber Dark Impact is the other secret that's pretty worth it. Flint Missile, Flint Lock, Hunter Dragon. I do like that. <clears throat> Believe it or not, with all the boxes I've opened, um, I've only pulled three, counting this one, uh, Rainbow Dragons. So, two Secrets and one Ghost Rare. So we have a Crystal Seer. <clears throat> not the best. Dark Bright would be the only Ultra that I think is worth it out of here. Or maybe even Chthonian Emperor, uh, Emperor Dragon. Those are the only two that are actually worth it. Ojama Knight. Ooh, a fifth hope. Chrysalis Mole. So I'm hoping to get uh, two ultimates because uh, I don't think in uh, this set is when it started but uh, I don't think you're supposed to get two ultimates. Ooh, Summoner's Art. That's my, like, first one out of a few boxes. That one's actually hard to pull. So I am glad that I got that. 
Phantom Cricket. Trap Reclamation. I don't know if uh, people even want these cards, but uh, I have a ton of those. Those bamboo swords. I have a ton of these cards, actually, all of them. Counter, counter. And a Marine Neos. In my opinion, that guy should have been at least super rare. At the very least. Venom Snake. And we have a Zombie Master. That would probably be like the only one that's worth the most in uh, Ultimate Rare. But... I still like what I got. Neos Alias is really cool. Especially since uh, you can use him as Neos. That's what the, the card says. If you want to treat him as an effect monster, he becomes Neos. So Thousand Eyes Jellyfish. Alright, now off to the left side. The right side's been really good to me. Um, I haven't realized um, how many foils I've been pulling, but uh, usually if you get a secret rare out of these packs, you get nine foils, maybe eight foils. So there's quite a bit compared to some of the other boxes. Because uh, I know like my Lost Millennium, I didn't get a Ultra. I only got six foils, but I did get a Brain Control and a wing Karibo. I remember that clearly. Um, so, yeah. These sets, you're pretty much like guaranteed. Um, ulti uh, one ultimate, uh, I think it's one or two ultras, I could be wrong. But for sure, it's at least one ultra. And uh, if you get that secret, it makes the box. It just, it does. I've never seen anyone pull a two secret box, but that'd be pretty epic. Don Break Gardner, Snake Deities Command, Ritual Raven. I just love this set. I just am really, uh, I'm really into the GX cards right now. Flint Missile. Flax Pike. Alright, so we haven't had one foil on this side of the box. It's actually kind of okay though because I got quite a bit on the first side this one's a foil you can see it's a little darker it's a monster card hopefully Chthonian Emperor Dragon Ultra oh, Necro Gardener still not bad that's why I don't mind opening this set they have a lot of good uh, super rares like that Zombie Master Necro Gardener Neos Alias is also a super. Ocean's Keeper. Uh, I'm trying to think what else they have, like Blazewing, Butterfly. Um, can't remember what else. Lucky Pied Piper. Um, most of the Gemini cards, pretty much. Counter, counter. And Lucky Pied Piper. So, that one's... Eh, that one's kind of off-centered. So I'm glad I got that Neo Alias. As an ultimate. Maybe we can get... One more ultimate. Oh, we got a... Venomenon, the King of Poisonous Snakes. So there is two Ultras right there. 
I'm really glad that I got that rainbow dragon. That was pretty epic. Fossil Tusker. Two packs left. Counter, counter. Phantom Dragon Ray Bronto. Light Effigy. And last pack of the Tactical Evolution. See what we can end with. Another counter counter. Next, chrysalis larva, and it's another foil. What is it? I don't know, I can't think of it. Doom Shaman, that's the other super. That's pretty cool. Pretty good box overall. Um, one summoner's art out of the whole box. So, pretty crazy that <laughs> you only get one. But, I guess it is what it is for the rares. So we got Doom Shaman, Venomenon, Lucky Pied Piper, Necro Gardener, Zombie Master, Fifth Hope, Crystal Seer, Rainbow Dragon, Secret Rare, it's pretty sweet. And we have an Elemental Hero, Neos Alias. So pretty awesome. These are probably the best two cards that I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll catch you on my next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.